an urgent cleanup effort after this week's floodwaters damaged more than two dozen classrooms at Bancroft Elementary School in Spring Valley. Good evening, I'm Marcella Lee. And I'm Jesse Pagan, in for Carlo Cicchetto. As CBS 8's Ariana Cohen tells us, students are now having class somewhere else as crews work to clean up the mess. Here at Bancroft Elementary School, 32 classrooms flooded from Monday's storm. Now, 500 students are in classes at another school nearby. None of us were expecting how bad it was going to be. Our classrooms were underwater and mud. And even where we're walking, you could not see the cement that we're walking on now. La Mesa Spring Valley School District's Robert Cochran walked me around Bancroft Elementary School in Spring Valley to show the damages caused by floodwaters. I had prepared an evacuation plan. We had buses on site ready to take them to another uh, school if the situation had become worse. These pictures show how the classrooms looked Monday. The school hallways and floors ravaged by floodwaters bear the visible signs of extensive damage and deterioration. The mud that you see that's caked over there extended all the way to where I'm standing. Students were sent home early Monday and classes were canceled on Tuesday. Now, hundreds of students are taking class at Spring Valley Academy, just a few miles away, where additional space was available. You talk about all of the staff, uh, our maintenance and facilities staff that have uh, worked diligently to, to clean up what are really just catastrophic messes. Crews are power washing the school's sidewalks and large dryers and humidifiers are in the classrooms as they continue to clean up. I'm so encouraged by the fact that everyone has come together to really accomplish what's almost seems like an impossible task. The district says they are unsure of the timeline of when classes will resume here, and they reiterate that student safety is their number one priority. In Spring Valley, Ariana Cohen, CBS 8. All right, Ariana, 